right around the time you were born, Doug West, known as Flight 5 in Minnesota, Isaiah Ryder, and Kevin Garnett were thrilling the crowds at Target Center. What about this version of the Timberwolves yourself, Andrew Wiggins, Zach Levine? I mean, can you see the energy at the Target Center off the charts like in the mid-90s? Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, I can see that. Uh, the biggest thing for us is that we're so athletic and so fast. So I think it's gonna be a very different game that uh, Minnesota hasn't seen in a while. How about Kevin Garnett? I saw you were stretching right next to him and communicating a lot with him. What have you picked up from him so far? Uh, for me, the biggest thing is uh, don't try to be the Carl that I was in college, trying to bang with people for 40 straight minutes. It's not going to work when you have four games in seven days. By the third game, you have no legs left. He's just giving me a lot of tips more about the season than just summer league, but also to help me play at a better level. He's going to be the rock that uh, holds me together during this long season. Now, you're no stranger to great NBA players interacting with them. You, of course, played against LeBron James, and you've interviewed Kevin Durant, and you've taken a picture with Magic Johnson. What experience did you get from that, and, and how are you putting that to use now? For me, just going out there, understanding this is a blessing to be here. Understand that every little kid who comes up to me was just like me when I was growing up, wanting to meet these great players, these NBA players. And the biggest thing I took away from you was humility. And you never know when this game will be over. It could be over next week, it could be over 20 years from now. What do you think we can expect when the season starts? I think the biggest thing you're going to see is a versatile player that's going to go out there and open up the court for a lot of great players. Uh, I'm going to open up the court for Andrew Wiggins, I'm going to open up the court for Zach Levine, I'm going to open up the court uh, for Rubio to have a much smoother time operating inside. Uh, open up the court for Nikolai Pekovic, open up the court for my mentor, Kevin Garnett. I think it's going to be a very int intriguing uh, season when you have uh, a lot of scorers on one court who are willing to pass to each other. In the community, you've always shown such incredible patience, especially when you're with kids, reading to kids, being around kids. Okay, said Froggy, but first I have to find my boat. How much is that patience going to help you on the court Maybe if things don't go as planned. Uh, without my patience, I wouldn't understand that this is a process. You know, you're not supposed to be great from day one. Uh, there's going to be roads that sometimes are going to be bumpy, but you just need to get over that bumpy road and uh, get to the smooth road. There's been so much going on in your life recently. Is it fun, though? It's very fun. I mean, I'm having a ball playing here uh, in Minnesota, being able to put that jersey on every day, uh, playing at the Summer League. Uh, it's been absolutely amazing. And, you know, it makes it the best that I've went from a great group of teammates at University of Kentucky to another great group of teammates here in Minnesota. I'm having a blast but just playing, talking, uh, socializing with my teammates every day uh, and going through this grind that is the NBA.